Howdy, this is Marissa with Marissa Moments. So let's talk recurring dreams that are really vivid. Yes, honestly, what I received is that those two are visions. That's why they keep repeating over and over and over because what I receive is that they can either be for you or someone that is really close to you that you might have the um, propensity to share with con con constantly. What are words? Anyway, um, what I receive behind that is you need to take a closer look at what you're saying because there are various different messages interwoven within what it is that you see, feel, hear, experience, all of those things, especially when it comes to the astral world realm, however you want to refer to it, right? So what I would suggest is just taking a closer look, break it down. And you don't necessarily have to go based off of what somebody else tells you or even what society says, right? Because um, sometimes society may say to fly is to soar and to elevate when maybe for you to fly means fear. Maybe it means obstacles. Maybe it means freedom. Go with what resonates with you, but break it down. And what makes it a lot easier as well is write it down. Write down what you see and then you can split the uh, the page, right? Old school style, fold the page in half, one side with your vision, the other side with your, your translation. What does each part mean to you? And then feel into it. See how it applies to your, your life or maybe your current circumstances or maybe a recurring circumstance because if it's a recurring vision, then odds are good it's based in and rooted in something that you constantly feel like you are trying to overcome or something that you are constantly having to face. So I hope that helps. It is a vision. You are a visionary is what I received. You are a visionary. Yeah, that came from spirit. So that has to be for you, to you, about you. So break it down and then apply it. <laughs>